and all that. I was kind of mad at myself, but I just told him that the reason why I went back in college is because I was trying to make a play because it was in a key situation, but in the backfire on me. Uh, in practice, what we're doing is, you know, just to pooch punt, you know, just with the kickers and us, you know, make sure we're on the 10-yard line do not go back, you know. But it was just one mistake. I know I'm not going to make it again. So I'm not worried, really worried about it. He's not really worried about it. Yet. I think you said one position you can't really cycle guys in and try different guys out is punt returner. It's really right. important to have that comfort level there. For you, how much has that grown, and how important is getting those reps and just kind of getting back there and doing it? I mean, it's really important to get back there and get, get reps because uh, the more catches you do punt return, the live action you see, the more comfortable you feel. And also, you know, you, got, you have to trust your team teammates because they're the reason, like, if they hold up their blocks and stuff, you can set up a punt return. You know that you have time to catch the ball, look it in, and then look up. You're not going to get blown up. But uh, I feel more comfortable after the Oklahoma State game. I feel a lot more comfortable catching punts. Uh, I know that the people that are on the line are definitely going to do their job in protecting me and giving me a chance to return. So getting, get, getting more reps, and especially with that group of people, definitely is a benefit. They also said uh, open auditions at, at kick return this week. Were you one of the guys in there working that out, and, and what's that like for you? Yeah, I'm one of those guys working it out. Um, what it's like for me, uh, just another opportunity to get on the field. So, what's the mentality like this week? You know, you got the big win Saturday, but you got to turn around, and do it all over again. They're coming off a of bye week, and it's hundreds of miles away. Uh, the mentality this week is the same as it was for Oklahoma State. Oh, come to find out, we are a 28 point underdog against Baylor. That's, I mean, everybody keeps down to us. You know, we're just here to pre play as a team. We know what we can do inside at, as a team. The pe other people don't really understand what we have and our potential as a team to succeed. And uh, we feel that, that we will definitely prove them wrong when Saturday comes. What else was returning kicks for you guys? I mean, he said open up. Uh, it's uh, me, me, Charles Sims, Wendell, and then Worley. Uh, Avery Williams and Travis Bell. Okay, so do you guys at this point have any idea, or is it really? It's still up for week? grabs. I think it's going to be a game time decision. Okay, but it's up for grabs. For you, what's the past year been like? Um, obviously, some high highs, and, and it seems like some low lows. But but to get where you are now, I mean, how? Uh, it's definitely been like a learning experience. You know, definitely a mature, like a maturity way season, just in time for mature and stuff. Um, you know, I feel like I feel like I could play a bigger role on this team that I did last year. And uh, I know that I, I'm one of the receivers that have the experience as well in the group. But I can like help people, you know, know what they're doing wrong, know what they're doing right. Uh, off season definitely got a lot stronger, faster too. But um, it's definitely been, I mean, like the lows, I was injured. My, I injured my shoulder like early up in camp. But other than that, you know, I got missed the whole entire week. Like the entire camp, I only played the first week of camp. And that was kind of like, I was kind of down on myself because I had to work myself back from the depth, bottom of the depth chart and work myself all the way back up. But um, they definitely learning experience because I've been to the top, I've been to the bottom. And so I know what it takes to get to the top and stuff, regardless of where I'm. You always have to keep your head up. And I always kept my head up, kept my faith in God and everything. So it's definitely been a good season.